Good. We're lined up. Great. Track's even going to be a little cooler. That'll be fun. That'll be fun. Trust in you guys. Don't disappoint me. Don't disappoint me. You're going to disappoint me. I know it. I already know what's going to happen. They're going to crash into me. A lot. A lot. Hopefully they pop dinner first because I am about to be rammed from behind like no other. And it's not something I'm consenting to. That's not the point. Hmm. More hair in my mouth. Uh huh. Did we get a launch? Hair in my mouth. Be nice on this first turn, please. Gosh, did you feel that? That was about as loose as it could get. Yikes, see what I mean? That's fine. Now this is pod racing. You know, I get bored at first. I wanted to make it interesting. And that's that. That's exactly how it felt. I just wanted to make it interesting. Tires cold, tires cold, tires cold. Yikes, this is the worst part of the track. Death sentence. Okay, dude, you can accelerate a little bit more. You don't say. Yeah, we'll catch everyone. I mean, come on, they're three seconds slower than me. It's like freaking Apple on broadband. I installed my AOL disk. I have 500 hours of free internet service. Hashtag 90s kid. Okay, anyway. Now I just gotta buckle down. We got 15 laps. So we got 13 laps to get it right. Breaking a little early. Then again, that's why you have slower lap times. Okay, peace out my dude. Still kind of cool tires, we need to keep that in mind. We'll catch up to those guys, especially because they'll mess up. I don't think they have builds either. That's the other thing. I don't think many of them have builds for this track. I don't either. My build is that a random guy made while on Charlotte. Counts though. Oh yeah, we're catching them. I wonder if they're also breaking too much just because it's the first uh, time on the track. I loaded my build, right? I think I did. Feels really loose. Marching, no! See ya! Those two are gonna wreck each other. That's just fact. 143. Okay. Is it really? Hamilton again. Apexes and exits, mate. Apexes and exits. Yeah, we'll catch them. No, 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 no. Okay, we'll catch them. 
Dang it, I knew I was gonna go a little while. Wait, who's calling me? Who's calling me? I don't know. Why are you calling me? Random number? Don't text and drive, kids. It's not safe. Especially when I'm driving this track. Check your accident waiting to happen. Leave a message if it's important, you jack wagon. And if you're important enough to me, I'll get back to you. Really, dude? You wanna give me just a tiny bit of space? Hamilton again. Nice and easy, nice and easy. Like a glove. Like a glove, like a glove. That's what I mean. So I think we're in third? Fourth, okay, same thing. Is it though? Because we started at first. Yeah, because we keep messing up. You need to be very careful on that freaking turn. Holy crap. Oh, we are third. Okay, cool. Since I messed up, I am being a tiny bit more careful, and by a tiny bit, I mean not really. Yeah, we'll catch him. Okay, come at me, bro. I need your help. Which turn are we on? Oh, another yellow flag. Beauty. Everyone's slow into the corkscrew. Oh, hey, look at that very safe rejoin. I love that. Are we gonna go too wide on this? Use the force, Luke. Thank you. I don't know what place I'm in at this point. Let's see, there we go. Back markers, right. The dangerous part of this race, back markers. But luckily first is right in front of us, little Michael Woods number five. Mumbo number five. Okay, here we go. Dollar dollar bill, 142s, we need to hit 141s. We were doing 140. He's gonna break early. You're a back marker, act like it. I don't know what I mean by that, but we gotta catch first. We can't have back markers ruin that track for us. I keep breaking here. You technically don't need to, but I didn't. I'm on the hunt, I'm after you. Come at me, bro. I need first place back. Can you just be so kind and give it back to me, please? I mean, don't get me wrong, I'm gonna earn it. Of course there is. Just let, just let me have this. You know, I'm just gonna pressure you and rely on that you're just gonna mess up because you're not that good. Then again, you got second. I kind of assume that you had some skill. I'm not that good at this game, but... Cool. But I qualify first. How can I stay between the lines when it's a curve? Yeah, we're faster than him by about a minute. Or a second. Not a minute, that's ridiculous. Hey, how's it going? I'm the guy that started in first, if you remember. I kind of messed up in the beginning, but I came back. Just so you know, just come here. Come here. Can we talk about this like civilized adults? Wow. Breaking way early. He's feeling the pressure.
You're gonna break here, aren't you? How's it going? We have taken back first position. Well, then Anakin Skywalker right there, which is true because we hate sand. That's just fact, especially on this track. Now we just gotta rely that we actually have uh, good enough momentum to not mess up, like a bunch of dinguses. Lean into it, baby. So far, so good. Lean into the brake a little bit more. Okay. Yeah, we got this. Oddly enough, that worked out strangely well for us. I'm surprised. Hmm. Am I? Yeah, we need to go faster. Nothing to worry about. The biggest thing we have to worry about is me messing up. If I mess up, then yeah, we're in trouble. If not, we got this. These people are slow enough that I can really take it easy. Hopefully minimize my mistake. Thank you. People are getting 39s and 38s, and we're getting low. We hit 40 and warm up, so. That felt good. That's how you need to hit it. Okay, got it. Well, sadly, I think the rest of the race is gonna be kind of boring. Oops, I'm mad. Mm, so we're the fastest, okay. That's what I get for racing on a Monday. Woo, that was close. This thing can touch the sand and it just spins out like nobody's business. Staying alive, staying alive. Ooh, that was good. Okay. Or horrible enough that it worked, either or. Don't tell me that. Ooh, you hit a good groove and that, it just feels so nice when you do. Okay, you need to turn a little bit earlier to that. Okay, good to know. Is that this one? It has to be. I don't know. I don't know. It would be a hairpin in this track. I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. I'm thinking. I'm picturing all the different turns. There's 141. Thank you.
Ha! <laughs> Saw that coming. Called out Hamilton how many times? Gosh. That's sad. I wonder if we need a downshift on that part. It would make sense just to have the lower gear while going uphill. Ooh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay. I need a number of these. biggest thing that helps you out is just knowing how the car works. I mean, knowing the track would be one thing, but knowing how your car will behave on the turns is completely another. So, and after driving this car for, what, probably about six months now, you really get to know it. Oh, gosh, no! <laughs> Who put that there? Traffic cones. Where traffic cones don't belong. How do you think that's supposed to make me feel? Not safe. That's how I'm gonna answer my own question because I'm awesome. Not really. But. Okay. Okay. A lot of people disconnecting. Whoa! No worries. Just downshifted early. Ha! My bad. Oh, it'll wake you up. Woo! That's scary. Let me just go into this blind right when you say, hey, there's an accident that happened in front of us. Okay. Gained a little bit, but not horribly. That was a bad mistake though. Okay, that made it, that added three seconds to our lap. Not a bad thing, but we got time. We're fortunate. I don't know, racing in VR is just, I think it's probably the best. I mean, triple monitor is good and all. But like with this, I have the free roam. I don't have to click a button. To figure out if there's someone beside me, I can literally just look and it's very natural compared to clicking. Because when you click, I don't know. I just, um, I generally lose more of the, where I am on the track and it generally can cause more problems, in my opinion. Plus, can you really, not enjoy this field depth of field that it's added i mean the fact that you can actually tell distance that's that's huge i think i think just depth of field alone adds far more uh advantage and i think once people get over the motion sickness they'll race in vr a lot a lot better than they would with the triple monitor. Now, some people complain about the resolution. That's fine. Valid. At the same time, it's not as bad as you would think. 141's again, good. Thank you. Yeah, next race we'll do it with the uh, track lines off. We. We know it. I just wasn't 100% certain since we didn't have time to practice before. We know the track. We know the track, we just didn't know the track with the car. Apparently we did though. We're a 1300 I rating and I think we're still somehow in the lower, which is surprising. We had 61 people, so the field 
the strength of field should have what well, probably like three or four lobbies so we should at least not be in the middle one or the last one last one should be the 800s and lower 900s and lower we'll find out after this that's for sure can't wait to see the highlights sense. Almost there. Two laps left. That's the best I've taken that turn. Wow. Dang, this might be our best lap so far if we can keep it straight. After this track, we'll practice if downshifting right there is the best move. Because I'm curious, I think it is. It feels like it would just be better to be down a, down a gear while going up here. That was a little bit slower, but I think we still recovered fairly well. Woo, close call. This is a tough track. This is one of the first tracks I ever learned. That's the only reason I decided to do this with so little practice. But it is a really good track once you get the hang of it. But holy crap, that downhill blind chicane. Worst thing ever. Worst thing ever. I can't tell you how many. I probably did 30 laps just trying to learn how to do that part right. But I mean, like, at the same time, I was brand new at, at racing. I didn't know breaking points. I didn't know any of that. And that was rough. I Because... I went from need for speed to this. Or, well, to Gran Turismo to this, but I didn't understand Gran Turismo either. The only tracks I could do in Gran Turismo with the controller, not even with a wheel, was NASCAR. And I didn't know how that even worked. Didn't know about saving tires or anything like that. And I would just play Daytona over and over again on online lobbies, not knowing, even holding my line and stuff like that. I didn't know any of that. And so when I came back and decided to go into iRace, because I've always loved racing. Okay. Um, it, it took me so long just to kind of get the hang of driving. Ooh, some sparks. So, but once I got the hang of it, and don't get me wrong, I am not the best by any means. I'm like intermediate at best. Okay, wow, a lot of people are quitting. I'm curious to see how many do not finishes we have. 141, two, nice. This was a really interesting race. <laughs> Can't wait to see the highlights. Well, the crashing more than anything. That's why we. That's why we care about racing. That's the only reason most people watch NASCAR for their crashes, right? 
Although after knowing like the strategy and stuff of NASCAR, I am actually like really intrigued on watching it. And it's really cool to see just kind of the strategy that they have. <clears throat> I like these cars because they are slower and that is a lot more fun for some of the more difficult tracks. Um, but this is just a huge beast to, you know, just learn to control on your own. <clears throat> Good job. Here we go. And that is first freaking place confirmed and conquered. There we go. I wonder what place we fell back to. I think probably 10. Thank you. I think so. That would have been sad if we would have lost that after being three seconds faster in qualifying. But I am glad we actually fell behind because that would have been a boring race otherwise. All right, guys. Well, good win. Appreciate that. Look at that beauty. Uh, apple for the win anyway guys so with that let's go ahead and take a look at some highlights
All right, and we're all at different levels. You know, that's perfectly fine. So let's go ahead and take a look at the results. So it looks like we were at the middle so with a strength of field of 1150. Of course, we got first place started in first place. And um, after that, of course, we do have uh, one, two, three, four, five people who got disqualified. And then one, uh, two three, four people who got disconnected. So uh, the most for the I rating increase, of course, was 89, which was me. Um, I mean, kind of expected I was at 1,200 and got first, so not too bad. And then the lowest, though, it looks like was Joel Conley at negative 93. Now, the interesting about that is Hamilton actually almost beat him. He should have probably beat him just with how many incidents he had. I mean, completely disqualified and wrecked like no other. Anyway, guys, Hopefully you enjoyed this video and there are more to come.